girlfriends, we don't go out every night. Sometimes we like to stay at home and we'll have like slumber parties. Yeah? Well, we're like, uh, watch those uh, cheerleader movies. Have you seen them? It's like, bring it on, bring it on again, bring it on in it to win it, bring it on at the bar. And they go, hey, Becky, there goes your boyfriend. <laughs> Gross. Hey, Jen, there goes your boyfriend. Gross. Hey, Kelly, there goes your... That actually is my boyfriend. And I asked him out. I haven't had the best look with guys. Like, my ex-boyfriend, he was really into erotic asphyxiation. And by erotic asphyxiation, I mean he was fat and I couldn't breathe. <laughs> He was, he was a good guy though, like, I, when we broke up I really missed him, and when I missed him I got really sad, and when I got sad I got depressed, and when I got depressed I would eat, and I would constantly find myself just sitting in front of the vending machine, and my head's telling me I want a Snickers, but my heart's telling me just to tip the vending machine on top of myself and remember the way things used to be. <laughs> you too, ma'am? You too? I like to watch that show, 16 and Pregnant, have you guys seen that? That show makes me feel so much more better about my life, you know? That show, that show is produced by a guy whose name is Morgan J. Freeman. How shitty is that 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 is your name? You walk into a room and instantly everybody is disappointed that it's you. Like even your parents. It's like, oh, well your mother told me Morgan Freeman was coming over and I just thought maybe this one time it would actually be him. I think my parents went around the whole like pregnancy thing really good, like positive reinforcement. Cause like most girls, they get money for every like semester they get good grades. I got money for every semester I wasn't pregnant in high school. Like my dad's like, ah, three more semesters and you can afford to go on spring break. But just remember, no drinking, walking, you know what, just don't get pregnant. That's what you're gonna do. Uh, that's why I never wanna have like a teenage girl. It's like I never want to have to deal with like the pregnancy issue. I know I, w I want one boy and I want him to be just like Jesus. Because you think about it, you raise him up, you always think about it, like it's always popping fly chicks. You never hear of like an average rapper singing like, yeah, I walk up in the club, my swag will be medium. Yeah, I get up in the car, it's alright, got good mileage. I got a fly honey, kind of fat, but you've got a good personality. And rappers can say anything and it sounds cool, anything. I was listening to this rap song and this guy was talking about girls shaking it on the floor and he goes, yeah, chicken noodle soup. I was like, what kind of gangster Tourette's was that? I don't, I don't understand the chicken noodle soup thing, but it sounded cool, like it sounded like it went with it. Uh, Besides being a rapper, I think being a construction